Today we're talking about two different 3D printing filaments. We have PLA and we have ABS. We're going to do a cross comparison of PLA versus ABS. These are the differences, what you need to know for 3D printing them. When it comes to 3D printing, the choice of filament can significantly impact the quality and functionality of your prints. Two of the most commonly used filaments are PLA and ABS. Both have their distinct characteristics and advantages, making them suitable for different applications. Today we're going to explore the differences between PLA and ABS filament for 3D printing. Let's first talk about composition and properties. PLA is a biodegradable thermoplastic derived from renewable resources such as cornstarch or sugarcane. It is known for its ease of use, low printing temperatures, and minimal warping, making it a popular choice for beginners. PLA is also available in a wide variety of colors and specialty options, including silk, glow-in-the-dark filaments, of course. Now, ABS. ABS is a petroleum-based thermoplastic that is known for its toughness and impact resistance. It requires higher printing temperatures and is more prone to warping and emitting fumes during printing. However, ABS offers excellent durability and can withstand higher temperatures compared to PLA, making it suitable for functional and mechanical parts. The next major difference is temperature resistance. One of the key differences between PLA and ABS filament is their temperature resistance. PLA has a lower glass transition temperature, typically around 50 to 60 degrees Celsius. This means it can soften and deform at relatively low temperatures, making it unsuitable for high temperature applications or parts that may be exposed to heat. ABS has a higher glass transition temperature, around 105 Celsius. This makes ABS more suitable for parts that need to withstand higher temperatures, such as automotive components or out outdoor applications. Another big difference between the two filaments is their mechanical properties. PLA is hard and has a high degree of stiffness, which is great for parts requiring precision. It is also more ductile, allowing it to flex rather than crack under pressure. Next, let's talk about the ease of printing. PLA is generally easier to print with, requiring lower temperatures around 190 to 220 Celsius and less stringent printing conditions. It adheres well to the print bed and has minimal warping, making it suitable for beginners and those without an enclosed 3D printer. ABS is more challenging to print with due to its higher temperature requirements, around 220 to 250 Celsius, and has a tendency to warp. It often requires an enclosed printer to maintain a stable environment and reduce warping and cracking. Additionally, ABS emits fumes during printing. It is necessary to have good ventilation when printing ABS. Next, I want to talk about post process processing and durability. PLA is relatively easy to sand, paint, and glue. However, it is less suitable for outdoor use due to its lower temperature resistance, and it also degrades under UV. ABS is more durable and can be chemically smooth using acetone to achieve a glossy finish. It is also more resistant to UV light and weathering, making it a better choice for outdoor applications. All right, so let's talk about practical applications. PLA is ideal for prototypes, decorative items, and parts that require high precision and a good surface finish, where ABS is best for functional parts that need to withstand mechanical stress, impact, or higher temperatures. It is suitable for automotive components, enclosures, and outdoor applications. In summary, both PLA and ABS have their unique advantages and are suited for different applications. PLA is easier to print with, offers a wide range of colors and specialty options, and is ideal for indoor and low stress parts. ABS, on the other hand, provides superior toughness, impact resistance, and higher temperature tolerance, making it suitable for functional and high stress applications. Hopefully this helped you learn the differences between PLA and ABS and what you want to be printing with. Hit me up in the comments if you guys have any questions. I'm a normal dude and do reply to all. I'll also throw links to my five top favorite brands of filaments in the description. Please consider buying using my affiliate links. And also guys, please subscribe.